Okay, everyone. <laughs> we are finally back on the Isle of Delfino. Let's get Mario back up. And let's just get started already. Oh. Okay. So, when we last left off, I believe we defeated Petey Piranha in Bianco Hills. Yep, down with Petey Piranha. And we are currently at three shine sprites right now, and let's just go in for the fourth. So basically, with the Super Mario Sunshine, you get Flood, right? You get this... I don't know the ac what the acronym stands for, but basically you get this little hover mechanism that is extremely useful with any type of platforming. But with the secret shines, which is what we're heading to right now, you don't really get them because they take away your flood in the shine, as shown by a little I don't know, a little animation. Um before you actually get into the cave secret. Oh. And this is the easiest way I found to get up here. So basically, as you can see here, they take away your flood, or Shadow Mario does, Metal Mario or whatever it is. And you're taken to the secret, which is actually really short compared to some of the other ones but this is the first secret you encounter and oh my god i almost failed at this first secret we encounter okay so basically this goes back to your platforming from super mario 64. yeah you're just working with jumps ground pounds and ledge grabs and basically, it's kind of nostalgic. Oh dear lord. Okay, luckily we made it. Oh my god. These, these were super stressful. Oh my god. They still are. But simple enough, really. And first shine of the episode, which is nice. So basically, what you have to do there is just, like, be good at platforming. And, <laughs> honestly, I used to be terrible at these types of shines. Actually, sure, we'll take care of this little thing that they keep showing whenever we enter Delfino. So, if you remember the last episode, which was in terrible quality, I might add, we fought a weird little boss thing that came out of goop like this. And it is this guy. I can't remember how many hits he's supposed to. Ah, oh, dang it. Did he, did he die? No, he didn't. Okay, sorry, I've been really quiet. I'm trying to get this glitch. Oh no. I'm trying to get this glitch that happens if you defeat him and then go into Bianco Hills. It's really difficult to do. Ah, I'm not talking. Thank you. 
nach und nach nachladen. Ja. Okay, so basically, if you get the animation for defeating him, you get that, and Mario is transported to. Mario is transported right here, and then if you jump in here, you can go to the next world. But if you complete the glitch that I was talking, <laughs> I was talking about, you have to defeat him and then run over here and then jump into Bianco Hills. And as soon as you get into the, and as soon as he dies, you're transported to this little screen right here. So, the thing with the cave secrets, you have an option to do something. You have an option to go back with Flood and collect red coins. I'm sorry if this commentary sucks, it's kind of late at night. But oh well, I just felt kind of, Oh, whoa, that was weird. Um. <laughs> Jeez, I suck. Oh wow. Okay, so basically, we'll see once I go back into this sh shine right here. Uh, I'm sorry, my commentary is terrible right now. And honestly, I don't like these red coin missions. Because honestly, I'm not all that good at them. So basically, collect the 8 red coins before the timer runs out. Good luck! It's kind of tongue in cheek. And like, a minute is enough time. I'm just terrible at this. I'm sorry, I'm in concentration mode. Um, basically, all you have to do is collect the eight red coins before the timer runs out. And they're nice enough to wish you good luck. Oh god! Okay, I made it. And... This is gonna be close. <sighs> These were- oh my god, super stressful. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> I was in like concentration mode, I'm really sorry if the commentary sucked for that, but basically, Jesus, I'm getting dizzy. Basically, what you have to do is collect the eight red coins, and they're nice enough to give you flood for this mission, which basically would be impossible without, because you have to get the things over there, the red coins. Honestly, I don't like the secrets in this game, not as much as I did in Super Mario 64. Let's pick that up. Oh my god. Okay. Oh. I'm sorry, my commentary is going to be like really bad for this one. Oh, I saved. If this... Oh god. Oops. I'll just re-get the shines if they saved over. Oh well. Ugh. Or, I don't know. I don't really have much to talk about. It's senior year for me. There's not much going on except... Except like all the senior type stuff, but it's not really that important to talk about. Like, senior pictures. Having to all of the senior events that they plan or that leadership plans. So basically, this shine is what it implies. Oops. Let's pick up eight red coins. I'm sure there's an optimal route for this, but I don't know it.
Okay, I'm not talking anymore. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so nervous about screwing things up. Is there? I don't think there's a red coin here. So. Um, there's not really much to oh. Except that I suck at platforming, even with a freaking hover thingy. Um, I don't know. It's not that I'm not excited for scenery, it's just that all of these big events that you're supposed to be excited for, it just never really, like... I don't know. It's just never that exciting for me. I just kind of saw them as just day-to-day -day things. Like, oh, stupid windows. Like, New Year's, sure, that's kind of important because that's basically a new year. And Christmas is always fine. I get to see, like, parts of... I get to see, like, my family and everything. And my birthday is always alright, because I get to... Oh, Jesus, what the heck? Oh. That's up. Okay. What was that? But, like, all of that big-time holiday crap, I just don't really get into it. Which isn't to say it's bad or anything. It's just that I'm not into that. Oh, by the way, I'm not collecting blue coins until I can get all 30 at once. So I can just do a nice little collection video, maybe just talk out a few things. Okay, so, yeah. yeah. I don't really have any really difficult classes this year, except for maybe physics and maybe psychology. But. I don't know, I like my classes this year. They're easy, simple enough. It's really nice. But basically, I'm just planning to just chill for the majority of this year. Because, honestly, I think after junior year, which by the way is like the hardest year for high school, um, it's really nice to just take a relax, to take a re <laughs> oh my grammar is amazing. No, just take a nice relaxing period of time, which would be your senior year, just take that time to chill. It's really nice to be able to do that now, because junior year is really stressful, because you have to worry, because that's the main year that colleges look at. Oh, that sucks. That's the main year colleges look at. Oh, jeez. Um, that's... Jeez, that's... I can't walk and talk even in a video. Oh, no. I can, I can walk and talk in real life. It's just that I can't really play a video game. And play at the same... I can't play a video game and play at the same I can't play a video game and commentate at the same time, which is... Which I'm wondering why I chose to start Let's Playing. Or at least I'm starting to question it. Oh sweet, I refilled a little bit of water. Okay, sorry, I'm not talking again all the time. But yeah, junior year is like the most stressful year anyone's gonna have in high school. Oh, jeez. Oh. It's just nice to have this relaxing period where I can just sit around and do nothing. Especially if you're taking like advanced classes junior year. Have fun. Jeez. 
Um, yeah, my junior year was not fun. Oh, I mean, it was a little bit of fun. You always gotta have friends to keep you sane. At least that's what I think. I don't even know why I'm doing all this clearing out. It doesn't really become pertinent until later. Oh, how'd that happen? What was I talking about? Okay, so. Back to this mission. I'm not sure how to get up there. Not like it. Okay, so back to this mission. It, as the name implies, PD Piranha strikes back. You have to fight him again, except he's kind of revamped. So, yeah. I actually have no idea where I. Oh, never mind. Okay, so, back to this shine. There he is. Just wake him up by shooting these little piggy things at him. I'm not entirely sure what they're called. If it was fire. Oh, and he's up. And basically, welcome back to another boss battle. Oh sweet, we're killing water. Basically, you have to spray him down. And watch out because he has a new little tornado attack. My camera isn't inverted. Nope. And he can toss up to three is the most I've seen. Yep, there's a third one. So basically just do the same thing as before. What? Oh my god. No, the water bottle. Oh no. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? And he's back up. This is dumb. I was not standing in front of him, so clearly I was not able to shoot him down or fill his stomach with water or whatever. Why? How come he's not falling down? There we go. There we go. What? Oh, damn it. Well, yeah, he can not. What? This is like the worst battle I've ever had with this guy. Open your mouth. Jesus. Yeah, this can get this fight can get really annoying. Especially if he keeps throwing tornadoes when all you need him to do is open his mouth. What? Jesus guy. How much water can he hold? Yeah, this episode is going to go longer than expected. Because it's stupid PD. Why? 
Oh my lord. Oh my god. This guy is giving me like the worst RNG ever. Oh god. There we go. Finally. Jeez, this guy. Let's find some coins. Shoot. Um, where's some coins? I could use a heal. Oh wait, I know what's the point. Actually, where's the flowers? Guess there aren't any. I'm just hoping the rest of this video goes without any complications. Okay, so yeah, he's a jerk. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Open. Damn you. Yeah, it's a waiting game. It's nice. No, third. Ah, <sighs> honestly, I don't like this boss. It's so repetitive, but I guess a lot of boss fights are. Like even with this revamping, he doesn't get harder. He just gets more annoying. It's not like a oh. It's not like I'm thinking, oh, this is such a new boss, such a new boss battle, because he can throw tornadoes at you. Where is it? Oh, shoot. And he's back down. Ah, oh, dang it. And then I'm just stupid, so... Where's he coming from? Oh my god, no. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Oh, this guy is so annoying. Really? Four? Oh, what? Open your mouth, open your mouth. There you go. And this is the final. Oh my god. I cannot die right now. No, 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 if that guy hits me, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, God. And let's end off the episode here. I'm sorry if the commentary sucked, but I'm kind of tired right now, and I just really wanted to record, but... Uh, it's whatever. I'll just... I'll just try harder in the next episode. But until then... I hope... What's my sign off? Huh. But until then, have a great day. See ya.